This bike here is my race bike, the Scorpions Flat Tracker. I don't, I've, I've got paperwork for it. I could ride it on the street if I put lighting on, on it, but after having experiences on the road with previous Triumphs, I'd rather just keep it in the dirt. You know, a couple hot laps is, usually a Triumph should be able to do that. This one hasn't let me down, other than a couple broken parts from the last race, but this bike showed up in my driveway. You know, I'm out there looking, people know what I'm, roughly what I'm into. <clears throat> yeah, it was an old chopper from Saskatchewan that was a mild chopper. Now it's designated for the dirt. It's never let me down. Every time I've raced it, first place. <laughs> this time, this time it's, the Kickstarter broke on me, so it's actually kicking over, which is amazing. But it's in the middle of getting pulled apart because I seem to be having a lot of tranny issues this season. The, the gear got stuck down, and this was a second, I think it was second lap. I got, we got, we show, our bike showed up late. We got to do, uh, I think, three laps as a practice run. So I made the three laps, and then we're out to a heat right away. Well, second lap, all of a sudden, the bike's in neutral, and it's revving. I'm like, ah, oh, whatever, it, it broke my tranny. So I push it off to the side, and then it dawns on me, okay, I shut the bike off. I'm like, maybe I can fix this. My primary chain came off. Hmm. So we got into the pits, pulled the cover off, put the primary chain back on, got it going again, ready to go. So hit the next heat, and uh, managed to do good on that. It, I think I won the, the second heat. The, the first heat, I, I don't know what that counted for, but I was out because it broke down. But So by the second heat, I came back into the pits and then we had to go up again for the third and I went to kick the bike over and the Kickstarter jammed on me. So dealing with the first problem, I, got, I overcame that. Now I've got this, not, not turning over, it's magneto fired. So I pushed it, put it in the gear, it jump started, that wasn't a problem. And I shut the bike off and I tried starting it again for the fourth race and it just wouldn't start. I, tried, I had a big hill to go down, I could not bump start the thing. So finally, I, I, I paid Dennis. I'm like, Dennis, I'll give you five bucks to push this up the hill. I'm beat and I'm done. Washing my hands, right? So he here comes down. Darren riding the, his flat tracker down and he's got a, a, a tow rope. So we hook the tow rope up to the front and he gets me up to the top of the hill and uh, I put it in a gear and it had, a just, it had enough uh, torque with it being towed by another bike to start it. So all of a sudden I'm back in the game. Yeah. Yeah, so ended up making the last race and then it was um, a tie be between me and this other dude. So they put us in a final heat lap and I ended up uh, making it. And the bike actually held together. So it was, a, it was a hard race and it was much more challenging than the previous year. But if you look at all the bolts, the motor mount bolt was vibrating off. I've got studs that hold the tranny in here that are all missing, floating studs in there. Um, the, the seat wasn't really holding on too well. The gas tank, I was losing all the hardware. I've got twist ties trying to lock nuts on, and it was a rattling mess. 